It's minus five today. We're not uh, extremely busy yet, eh? Everything's weather here. I've seen the, the one that are really delicious but uh, can be frightening at first. One with uh, bacon, bologna, uh, ground meat, sausages all in one. That Those are my favorites but they're, they're very uh, hardcore putin. It started as fries, uh, gravy and cheese and then people take it and they make it the most outrageous meal possible. You know, adding like peppercorn or uh, olives and anything goes and puts in so there's like a, 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 a competition who will make the most outrageous put in and that I think is part of the the, the thing that is fun and lovable about puts in it's so, it's so unpretentious why lobster put in why not you know it's a uh, it's part of being down east it's a big Canadian favorite and we're taking a um, put in which is a classic Canadian fast food and picking it up a notch. Recently, the Devoir, uh, which is like this elite newspaper in Montreal, they made this big study about what is the Quebec national meal and Putin didn't come out as a Quebec national meal, but a year after that, the Globe and Mail did the same uh, research and the same survey and then Putin was named the, the Canadian national meal so this thing that comes from Quebec is being adopted by the rest of the country but isn't even recognized in, the, in, in its uh, own province. So. Putin is a messy thing as a meal but also as a cultural item. <laughs> 